Okay, so you have this page here. Um, you're going to go to database, MySQL, MySQL. And then here you have a list of all your database um, databases that you created. Um, if you want to create a new one, you just go to create database. And you have description. Um, um, database username. I'm going to put uh, mm. Okay, so right now we have a um, database at the bottom here, OEMO2, and test database, and it's pending setup right now. So I'm going to have to continue this in a little bit. Okay, so the database is created here. Um, if you want to go to setup, Open Manager. Right here, you just have the uh, data, uh, the host name and the database name, and then, um, like for example, if you want to connect to the database, like in PHP, um, I'll show you that later. But this is what you're gonna use. It's going to be this, your host name, and then your username and password. Okay, um, I'm going to jump to Open Manager. Continue. And then the username and password that you created. What was my username? <laughs> Okay, so now you're in your database. Uh, what you want to do is probably create a table. Okay, so you click on your database. You create a name for a table. I'm just going to put table one. Or let's just say we want to like make an address book table. Um, address. And then number of fields. You're going to put let's say first name, last name, email. So that's one, two, three, and then you want to add ID. ID is going to be the key that um, determines, it's like a unique key. So it's first name, last name, and um, email. Okay, so that's four. Click go or enter. And then, so you have your ID, and then you have your first name and last name and email and this is gonna be uh, where is it now? it's gonna be an int and this is gonna be this, I'm just gonna put like 20 for each of these here this I'm going to put 20 also. Then this is going to be primary, I mean unique, and then go. 